alkynes. Alkynes are unsaturated hydrocarbons containing C triple bond C. This is the functional group of alkynes and its general formula is CnH2n minus 2. Okay. So the first member will be C2H2, then C3H4, next C4, H6, etc. are the compounds. Okay. Now the first member C2H2 is called as ethyne. Its IUPAC name is ethyne and it can be also called as acetylene. Its common name is acetylene. Okay. This acetylene can be used in the arc welding. Okay, arc welding in the form of oxyacetylene flame. Okay, this is a mixture of oxygen gas and acetylene. Okay, now what about the nomenclature of alkynes or naming? Okay, we can write in the IUPAC naming and common system of naming. In the case of common system of naming, the first member C2H2 is acetylene. Other compounds are written as the derivatives of acetylene. Let us see. C2H2. First member CH triple bond. CH will be the structure of the compound. It is called as ethyne. And common name. Common name is acetylene. Okay. Acetylene. Next compound C3H4. Okay. It can be like this C triple bond CH this is propyne and called as a common name is methyl acetylene okay okay according to the derivative of acetylene or it can also called as allylene okay now next compound is C4H6 okay this can be the structure can be drawn in two ways CH3, CH2, C triple bond, CH. This is 1 butyne and called as ethyl acetylene. Okay. Next member, next isomer is CH3, C triple bond, C, CH3. Okay. Second position, triple bond. So, this is called as 2 butyne. Or dimethyl acetylene. Okay. So we can see that two types of isomers are possible. Two structural isomers are possible in the case of C4H6. Okay. Fourth member. And so, and in this case, we can see that these two, these, uh, the triple bonds are at different positions. So these isomers are called as position isomers. Okay. So, alkynes shows positional isomerism. Okay. Now, it also shows chain isomerism. Let us see in the case of pendine. Fifth member. Next. Next member is C5H8. Okay. Five carbon atoms are there. Okay. It can be drawn in two ways. One straight chain and uh, branched chain. So, the, 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 since this shows two types of chains, it can see that it can uh, see that it shows chain isomerism. That is, alkynes shows chain isomerism. Let us see. CH3, CH2, CH2, C triple bond C. Okay. This is called as CH. Okay. This is called as 1 pendine okay now the next the branched isomer will be like this ch3 c triple bond ch okay this is 2 methyl okay 2 methyl but 1 i okay so, chain isomer and straight isomers are possible in the case of alkynes. So, this shows that alkynes shows chain isomerism also. Okay. Chain isomerism. Okay. It's much about the isomerism. Now, next let us see the structure of the triple bond in the alkene. Structure of triple bond. Okay. We know that alkyne contains triple bond and C triple bond C. Okay, 
according to that the structure of alkynes will be we know that these two carbon atoms are sp hybridized so this shows S sp hybridization okay we already discussed earlier under uh, hybridization of carbon compounds please refer that okay so sp hybridization this c triple bond c contains one sigma bond due to the head on overlap of two sp hybrid orbitals and two pi bonds are there due to the sidewise overlapping of each uh, another two sp hybridized orbitals okay so it contains one sigma bond and two pi bonds and the structure of this compound is linear and the angle between them is 180 degree okay this, this much about the structure of the compounds this also contains ch in the case of acetylene along with c triple bond c it also contains ch bonds okay so uh, now let us see the order of the bond strength of triple bond single bond and double bond okay what will be the order of the bond strength c triple bond c is more bond strength is having more bond strength c triple bond c is having more bond strength order of bond strength okay then c double bond c is having more than c single bond c okay strength will be order like this what about the bond length bond length will be the re reverse order okay that is c triple bond c is shorter than other two bonds so c triple bond c is shorter than c single bond c is shorter than c single bond so c triple bond c is the shorter bond length compared to other two okay these are the different uh, general introduction of alkynes